After start checklist, completed. Pedal full left, check. Full right, check. Full left, check. Full down, check. Full up, check. Pedal full right, check. Flight control check, completed. One hundred knots. V one rotate. Positive climb. Gear up. After takeoff checklist completed. My flight in north direction began under good weather condition. Because of the very short flight distance, I decided to program the APPR phase early. In the time, I was still climbing, but instead to go on FMC back to CLB phase, I returned only one step to CRZ phase page. This somehow initiated the FMC program to change to CRZ, with the result of lost of course direction. Why and how exactly? I do not understand until now. So I entered a direct fix to get back on course but it didn't work. I had to intervene and switch AP off, flying now the aircraft by hand. After several maneuvers the AP went on course but now for strange reason the Autopilot aircraft began to climb. Jet. It was short before top of descent so I dialed the approach altitude to let the aircraft begin with the descent. Although the weather conditions got worse, the descending with speed brakes extended to full proceeded easily. Now I remember that during flight, the You're wind was to set to zero, sensor. although I updated METAR weather information as flight began. As I became aware of it, I had to update METAR several times until at least wind condition appears on screen, causing a hard shake movement of the aircraft. Spoilers disarm. Spoilers half. Spoilers full. Passengers are wearing cabin ready for landing. Okay. Gear down. Flaps three. Flaps full. Radio altimeter alive. 2,500.
Three hundred. Hundred above. Two hundred. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Five. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Five. There is one important distinction between the A330 and the JAR A320, NEO. Only the A330 enable you to correct mistakes that influences the FMC functionality during flight. During a second landing at EPWR, I could even switch the auto throttle off, controlling speed manually during the last phase of approach, and land safe and perfect on runway. The swinging problem with the A320 is gone.